It's 100 degrees outside. What could be a better time to buy a sweatshirt and do a sweatshirt review? Welcome back to Life In My Shoes Reviews and Such. For this review, I am reviewing the Eddie Bauer Convector Pullover Hoodie. You may find yourself wondering, why would you be doing a review of a hooded sweatshirt in the middle of the summer when temperatures across the United States are ranging in the 90s to 100? Well, the sale was great, and as you may be aware, you can often catch a sale on seasonal items at the end of a season or off season. So purchasing this from Eddie Bauer Direct, this item is in their clearance section, and I will give you some details about that and about the product now. Now, about the Eddie Bauer Convector Pullover Hoodie. This is in the color cement. Uh, as I mentioned, I did purchase this directly from eddiebauer.com. This is not a sponsored video. I purchased this because I love sweatshirts and this in my area is the equivalent of a jacket. So it is a smart purchase because I'll probably wear this more than a jacket. So about the purchase, about the item, as I mentioned, this this is the color cement. They have another color, I believe, that is called sage. It is a greenish brown. I purchased it in extra large tall. One of the reasons I frequent the Eddie Bauer site is because it is one of the uh, retailers, online retailers, that carries the tall size. So I often buy tall from Eddie Bauer. Uh, the retail price for this is $90. Currently, it is on sale for $69.99. Uh, at the time of purchase, there was an additional 50% off on this item, uh, but they are running periodic sales. This is in their clearance section, so it is gonna be available as long as it's available. Uh, but I would say, if you like it, keep an eye on the sales they have and see if you can catch it with a significant discount. Now, let me give you an overview of the product as described by Eddie Bauer. With its knitted sweater fleece exterior and brushed fleece interior, this pullover hoodie combines great looks and functional warmth, works equally well on its own or as a cold weather layer. Uh, heathered yarns, it has hand pockets, uh, classic uh, for fit. It's a universal fit, not too slim, not too relaxed on the body. And materials say that it is 100% polyester imported. Now let's evaluate my thoughts and opinions in six categories, fit, style, materials, value, overall, and then finally, would I consider repurchasing? Fit. The sweatshirt is roomy. It is great as an overlayer, and the tall, for me, being six foot four, is adequate. As I mentioned, this sweatshirt could layer. It definitely is a great upper layer, but should you choose to wear this as a middle layer, be mindful that because of the roominess that the sweatshirt prov provides or allows, it will take up more space with whatever layer you wear on top of that. So just be mindful. It can layer and it will be great for layering, but you have to have the room in that layer to accommodate for this sweatshirt. Now to style. Uh, as you can see, I'm showing some images of me showing off the sweatshirt so you can see what it looks like. Uh, it is a very neutral color, so I think you can go anywhere with it. You can wear it with jeans, you can wear it with khakis. You have variety available from a style perspective. I feel that the sweatshirt is both rugged and refined. So the refined, some of the trim work around the pockets and around the hood and even at the, the uh, ends of the sleeve and the bottom seam, give it a little bit more of a refined look. Yes, you're not going to dress it up, but it does look nicer than just a traditional hooded sweatshirt materials. So as I mentioned, it is 100% polyester, 
But what I would say is the materials, at least now with minimal washes of the sweatshirt, the materials are soft ish. Uh, what I will also say is that the materials are very warm. Uh, just in the few uh, fittings that I had for the sweatshirt uh, with our 100 degree weather, putting the sweatshirt on and getting a few picks here and there for the video, it was very warm. So I think it is going to do a great job in the cooler weather of keeping you warm. And as I mentioned, this is something that in my environment potentially could find function as a jacket slash coat because we don't get terribly cold. And now the value. At the retail price of $90, I would say, ouch, that's a lot of money to pay for even a high quality sweatshirt. The discounted price of 69, I think it was 69.99, is much better. If you add any of the discounts that are currently uh, going on on the Eddie Bauer site of any percentage additionally off, I think you're starting to hit in that sweet spot of where this sweatshirt really hits its value. It probably is a great value at $69, but I know for me, I don't typically look in that price range for a sweatshirt. I would say the $45 range is around the upper limit of what I'd be looking for. So I think with a discount off of the $69.99, I think you really are looking at a decent value for something that will last quite a while. So what is my overall assessment? The sweatshirt is comfy. The sweatshirt is warm. The sweatshirt is stylish. Uh, my only kind of con, and it, again, it is on me, is I wish I would have gone a size smaller. I got extra large tall, which gives it a little more room, but I wish I had gone with a large tall in order to make it a better under layer. So with the extra large tall, I could wear bulkier under this, but I don't think I would wear anything much bulkier than a t-shirt under the sweatshirt, so I don't need the extra volume. I would like it as kind of that middle layer to wear under a coat when I make trips up north or anything like that. So would I repurchase? Absolutely. In fact, I will be continuing to watch the Eddie Bauer site as long as this product is on it in order to potentially buy that large tall at an even greater discounted price. As an added caveat slash bonus, I do shop at Eddie Bauer again because they offer tall. Additionally, they offer high quality. I have pieces of clothing in my wardrobe that are 10, 15 years old that are Eddie Bauer that were just high quality and they last. Now, what I will say is over the last 10 to 15 years, uh, what has happened is Eddie Bauer's uh, base price has gone up, which everything has gone up these days, but their price was going up before kind of the market was, was seeing that. And they started to price themselves out of where I would feel comfortable using them as a common re retailer. I continue to receive their emails. I continue to search their site occasionally. I do like their product. Their product is high quality. What you've got to determine is, would you rather pay a little bit more or a lot more for a product know that it's going to last 15 years or pay less for a product knowing you may only get five years of wear out of it that's your decision to make uh, on some items i'd say yes go with that for uh, eddie bauer pay a little bit more get a little higher quality and the product will last you in most cases much longer than a cheaper retailer so there you go that is my review of the eddie bauer convexor pullover hoodie I think they call it I'm a hooded sweatshirt guy and I don't prefer the term hoodie so I will say hooded sweatshirt even though they call it a hoodie thanks we'll talk to you next time on